And tonight, a do-or-die game. Shaq, what can uh, what can a team with its back against the wall do to shift the momentum in this series? You just got to remember what you work hard for all season. Let that fuel your passion and play like there's no tomorrow. Ooh. No tomorrow. Mm. If there is no, no tomorrow, tomorrow well, we've, got, we've got a lot of issues. Because if, if you don't no win, tomorrow. there won't be a tomorrow. Yeah. King Carter, King Carter, King Carter, I pop. King Carter, King Carter. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to another 2K Travesty. Yes, we are in the quarterfinals game five, but guess what? Nobody even cares to watch this game. Not live on TV, not streaming websites, not anybody's phone. Nobody even wanted to come to the game. We don't have one fan in the building. 2K, please fix your game. Now, while we were waiting for the fans to go ahead and get their concessions and everything like that, popcorn, drinks, all of that, we decided to slow the game down. So we finally put points on the board at 10 minutes and 45 seconds on the clock. Now, we still haven't scored either. I don't know what happened, man. It was a slow start. I couldn't get anything rolling. But Vooch takes a crazy jump shot, a leaner at that, and hits. Now, there's one thing that I hate. I hate when the computer helps me on defense. I have my help defense on zero. There's no reason why Vooch should have slid over to help me because this man was wide open in the paint. Now, Brandon Jennings' ankles did get broken there and the green release is good, but I think he should have fell. What y'all think? Now, I've been trying the analog since the game came out, and I just want to say one thing. I only hit shots with the analog when I'm in the corner. Everything else that I've been pulling this game is going to be with square. Expose the defense. Ain't that what everybody be talking about? <laughs> I ran a pick and roll right here, man. I noticed that O'Quinn slid over, so I hit Vooch on the baseline for the jump shot. I've been playing a lot of New York, and it seems like I know all their rotations. And I feel like I kind of know what they're going to do before they do it. I guess that's how it really is in the NBA, man. When you play a team so many times, man, you really learn their play sets, how their players play, their ups, their downs. And we get the rebound right there. I'm out on a break. My man hits me in stride. Pull up. Fake. Hit the mid-range green. You know, a little leaner. A little leaner. Let me go ahead and hit my deloading on him. <laughs> Now it's 23 to 20. New York is not out of it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not even going to lie. You, you guys hear the fans. They're here somewhere. You know? <laughs> but Melo takes Fournier on the drive, man. I don't know how Fournier is going to actually stop this guy. He's been going crazy all game. But I'm going to come down court and tell Fournier to go ahead and get a little bit of payback because Melo slides over for the double team, leaves Fournier on the island back there behind three, and Fournier hits the bucket. Now, I have to warn you guys. I know y'all hear the music right now, but somebody got the... Oh my Lord Jesus, pray for him. Please, he needs some milk. Oh, my God. Damn. Mm -mm -mm. And yeah, you know, I had to hit the green release little floater. Something light, something light. It's 49 to 44. I'm just trying to play defense here because Calderon, man, he gets on my nerves with his dribble sets, man. I, I think that I can rip him, but when I put the pressure on, bro, I seem to always get a foul call. Now, I know that he's a pass first kind of guy. He shoots a little bit of threes, but I don't know, man. Sometimes I just wish I could just take the ball every single time. I guess that's how it is when you're not playing on rookie or pro. You know what I'm saying? These foul calls come. But check out Young Justice on the island in the corner. Who leaves a man open in the corner? What's wrong with these guys, man? But it's 53 to 47. Pick and roll play. Kick it out to my man Vooch. Vooch pulls into his range and hits the baseline jump shot. That's what I'm talking about, man. Teamwork is the key, guys. Always been the key. And I don't know what's up with Porzingis, but he's just not feeling it this game. And I'm kind of happy about that because I'm going to my corner with the analog. Yeah, man, it, it, it's real, guys. Not even a great release for your boy. Hey, thanks, Kevin. Hey, dual threat with scoring and passing so far. How are you liking the tempo of this game? Uh, I like it, and I think the suits is great, man. Um, when we make plays like this, uh, it's easy to make decisions on the offense end, and, and that's how I've been able to set guys up and, and also get my own shots in. Appreciate your time, man. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. 
All right, guys. Now that the first half is over, we have a message from our sponsors. Nah, I'm 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 dead ass. I'm I'm so serious. Hashtag ad. World Gaming is hosting a new Madden 17 Super Bowl Series tournament for PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. With $10,000 worth of total prizes for PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, first place can get up to $3,000 if you win out. In order to join this tournament, go ahead and click the first link inside the description to sign up to World Gaming. Once you sign up for the website, all you have to do is go down to tournaments and click on Madden 17 to view the qualifiers. If you want to learn more about this 10K Super Bowl Series qualifier, make sure after you sign up, just go to the tournament page and click on tournament details. Back to the regular scheduled programming. All right, now that the second half is starting, I just got one question for you guys. How many people have ever looked at like their matchup? Like coming into a quarter, has anybody, or even from being subbed out, has anyone ever really looked at their matchup? Well, let me tell you about my matchup, dog. His name is Brandon Jennings and he is trash. Like super duper, like I'm talking about like the type of trash where not the one that they pick up in the blue bin. I'm talking about that juicy bacon grease, like you know what I'm saying, last night's dinner type trash. <laughs> like I'm talking about that trash drug juice, dog. Now I'm not gonna lie, New York really does not want to give up. They're trying their best to keep up with us, but we really haven't turned the heat on here, and we really are lacking on defense. Don't know what Aaron Gordon was doing on that play. Nobody will ever know. He just gave up a three. <laughs> All right, New York is actually doing good on offense right now, man. They've brung it within single digits, literally within four points. But we have something to say about that. My boy Jeff Green is going to go ahead and answer that right there with a three. And my playmaker badge has activated. Y'all know what happens when dudes begin their playmaker badges. Oh, yeah, all these ankle breakers, fam. Go ahead and stay on your tippy toes. But I kick it out to Surge and look what in the up uh, Surge do, bruh. He did a step back three pointer air ball, fam. What in the world did 2K like say when they was on the drawing board? Like, look, when these dudes wide open, fam, we gonna make them do step back tray balls. Like, who in the world would even think that, dog? But I'm out on a fast break with the 360 Kia Slam Cam Fam. 2K, what we doing? <laughs> I just I just want to know sometimes sometimes I got to go off script dog it's 79 to 68 and I just want to know what 2k be thinking sometimes even right there I would did a pull up jumper didn't really want to pull up I really wanted to stop and pop there 2k just say nah bro we're gonna give you this animation and you gonna love it but my man Bismack Biombo gets the block. I'm out on a break. I slow it down because I notice it's too many blue jerseys right there. Pass it back off to Biombo. Tell him, nah, bro. Go ahead, pass that back. You know, I got the man with the plan right here. Go ahead, set that pick. Come around the pick. I see my man at the three. He sees Justice up top and bang. All right, I got something real quick to say, dog. Now, at this point in the game, they're about to go ahead and sub me out for a few minutes. But I just wanted to show y'all my man at the free throw, dog. I really need to Google who this dude is because he is trash. Bro, you had all that time to think about what you was going to do at that foul line. You mean to tell me you shot that motherfucker right straight at the backboard fam? Not even near the rim. I mean, wide left, bro, like a freaking field goal, fam. Now, I just want to tell y'all something real quick. Your boy is nice with the layups, but I wish I could do this on every play. Split the defenders to the rack with the left hand and one. Now, I'm going to just let y'all know something real quick about me. All I did was press square there. But wouldn't you love to control what your player actually does? Like, I know if maybe if I would have flung the stick to the left, he might have still did that in that situation. But bro, I'm sick and tired of believing that 2K is going to do for me what I can do for myself. I'm, I'm a little scared. I don't know. Is it just me? But, like, I'm a little scared believing in 2K, fam. If anybody feel like this, bro, leave a comment in the comment section because this should be killing me, dog. Now, my man misses the corner three. Now, you know how I do, bro. Somebody got to go ahead and get the business green release. Bro. Bro. You mean to tell me. My man stepped back that far off that? Now look, I know what y'all thinking. Why is he showing us New York scoring points knowing damn well they can't come back? Fam, that was just a sequence, bro. Was really about to go down and what happened to my man falling on his ass. Now look, when I pulled that three-pointer, 
I was a little hype. I was happy as shit. I was jumping, and I just didn't get a green release, bro. Like, I, that's all on me. I take that one pause. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I take the whole blame for that. That's all my fault, man. I, I didn't mean it. Things happen, you know, when you when you hype playing 2K, sometimes you just don't know, man. But I'm out on the break by myself, and God damn, did my head hit the rim right there? Your boy got lifted something crazy. Now, this is one of the last plays of the game right here, man. Calderon to the basket, doesn't get it to go. Now, I'm going to go ahead and slow it down, you know what I'm saying, because this is what I do. But I notice it's an open paint, and you know I got to take the layup left hand. Easy buckets. Easy. Yo, Calderon got exposed this whole series bro there's nothing that i can say to ever bring this man back to life he's dead out here in the street you understand me dead but i want to thank you guys for watching the quarterfinals man the semifinals will be against the atlanta hawks please stay tuned for more of those videos on my channel and i'm gonna just say this right now bro i'm nice <sighs> man boy you were hot I don't know what to say, man. I was just getting to the rim all night. Fire, fire, fire. Rebounds. Well, I mean, good out everything. There. All that practice is paying off, man. <laughs> Looking good. It was like one on five. It's crazy. No, it was definitely five on five, man. Team effort. Oh, I'm modest. Hey, thank you for watching this video. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, please turn on notifications so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. Also, if you want to check out some of my previous videos, I do have two videos that you can choose from on screen right now. So go ahead and click one of those and check it out. Also, if you do like my park and pro-am gameplays and streams, you can follow me on Twitch. The link is inside the description.